Guys, so today is the day, Bitcoin Fridays, where we uh, pick our winner. Um, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification icon right below this video. So you'll be uh, notified of future videos where you'll be able to enter and hopefully win Bitcoin Fridays. Alright, so with that, let's go over to the entry video, which is right here. Let's copy this address. Let's head over to the random comment picker. Let's paste it in there. Search. 105 unique comments. Scroll down a bit. And let's pick a winner, guys. All right. Here we go. Baby7512. Keep up the good work. All right. Thanks. So congratulations, Bebe7512. Let's go over to my wallet, enter that address, make sure there's no space, send, and it's on the way. So congratulations again, Bebe7512. Uh, if you could comment down below this video and let me know for sure that you got the Bitcoin, I'd appreciate it. Uh, again, congratulations. If you guys, uh, again, are new here, don't worry about it. I do this every week. Um, every Wednesday, I put up the entry video, and every Friday, I pick the winner. So, still got plenty of uh, weeks and months ahead to win. All right, guys? So, this is... Um, this is week number five I've done this. So I've given away at $75 now. I've given away in Bitcoin. So that's pretty cool, guys. Um, let's check out what my rig did overnight. And then we'll do last week results, which really were skewed because of uh, some other nice hash payments I got coming in. Some people donated to me. I really appreciate that, guys. Um, so here's... Not even 24 hours into this week, 31 Raven coin mine, 0.6 Electronium, and we've done $2.19 on Bitcoin mines, which, here's Mining Pool Hub. So once this hits 0 0.0025, it'll pay out, and then I'll stop converting it to Bitcoin and just, um, just mine as Ethereum and send that over to Binance and buy Tron that way. Thanks to uh, a couple of subscribers pointed that out. So with that, uh, total electronium, 562. Uh, total verge, 3,771 as usual. Raven's up to 2,092. And Tron's going to be the same until I cash out and send it over to Binance and buy some more Tron. So 772 Tron. Uh, Sure, as everyone knows, the markets have taken a complete crap today. I'm down about $50, $48 from last week's uh, total. Um, the news on that, um, here it is. Bitcoin loses 9K support as markets react to South Korea investigation. And more importantly, the Mt. Gox sell-off. It seems like every time they have a sell-off, we get screwed. Bitcoin prices fell to three-week lows around 85.40 on May 11th as markets reacted to a flash investigation of South Korean exchange upbit and a fresh Mt. Gox funds liquidation. Data from Cointelgraph's price tracker and Coin360 shows BTC dipping sharply over the past 24 hours with major altcoin assets posting considerably higher losses of up to 18%. Traders appeared to deliver a knee-jerk reaction to news that Upbit, Korea's largest cryptocurrency exchange and a subsidiary of communications giant Kakao, had received a visit from the country's Financial Supervisory Commission. According to local media, authorities suspect Upbit had deceived customers by providing false information about its balance sheets. I also heard that... Uh, well, here it is right here. At the same time, executives in charge of refunding users of former Japanese exchange Mt. Gox have evidently sold 
a new chunk of about 8,000 BTC in four batches of 2,000 at a time. Such actions in the past had reportedly affected global prices several times since November. So, all in all, got some crooks doing some shady stuff behind the scenes. A couple of execs, execs at the Upbit exchange, and then, of course, Mt. Gox getting rid of a bunch of Bitcoin. That's 8,000 BTC. What is that? Times Bitcoin's about 8,500 right now. $68 million in Bitcoin. So that's a lot. A lot of uh, a lot of cash being liquidated here pretty quick. Let's see what the market's gonna do right now as we speak. If it'll load, my internet has been slow as hell lately for some reason. Don't really know why. So yeah, Bitcoin's at 8,600. It was all the way down to 8,400. So it's Bounce back a little bit. Looks like it's starting to level off right there. Hopefully, down below four billion, four hundred billion dollars market cap again. But it's like a roller coaster, I guess. It's got to ride the waves as they go. There's three of them that aren't down: the cred, nulls, and auger. So whoever has those is probably pretty happy right now. Yeah, so Verge is down, Ravencoin's down, Electronium and Tron, all everything's down. I don't know what percentage that would be, but it's a good good chunk of my mining profits are down right now. Let me see what the Ethereum is doing over the last 24 hours. It's been kind of jumping around my Ethereum 24 hour average. Click dashboard. So 0 0.0057, 24 hour average. I got all the way up to 0 0.0069 at one point and it's been dropping the past couple days. So I'm sure that's got a little bit to do with the price and maybe we got some more uh, miners on the network. Not quite sure. But in any event, um, guess that'll be uh it for today's video guys uh baby 7512 i believe it was if you can comment again below this video and let everyone know you got it i'd appreciate it um if you like this video hit the like button i appreciate it um if you guys have any questions or comments just put it below the video i like reading them like getting back to you i pretty much try and get back to everybody that comments so i really do read those and i do respond so I guess with that, we will uh, do this all again next week, guys. And thanks for watching, and I will see you all on Monday. Take care, guys. Bye.